humanity is a small step closer to putting astronauts on Mars, and making sure they are well fed while they are there. NASA designed an inflatable cylinder greenhouse that could help solve one of the biggest problems facing deep space exploration how to hold astronauts who are absent per year or who could never return home. The prototype Lunar-Mars Greenhouse project was created with the University of Arizona's Department of Agriculture and uses a process called the Bioregenerative Life Support System. This process essentially mimics the way plants grow on Earth. The approach uses plants for scrubbing carbon dioxide, while food and oxygen supply, Ray Wheeler, NASA's leading scientist on the project since humans exhale carbon dioxide, the greenhouse will collect CO2 from astronauts, allowing plants to generate oxygen through photosynthesis. Water is added from what was carried on board, or from a lunar landing site or hypothetical Martian. Water is oxygenated and given nutrient salts before watering the plants. It is then recycled into a storage compartment. The greenhouse can also be used for air revitalization and waste recycling. The whole system of the lunar greenhouse what represents, in a small way, the biological systems that are here on Earth. Researchers are now testing different plants and seeds to see what works best in space and specifically on Mars.